Hi everyone! So today's Glamourine look is this fun ice cream unicorn tutorial. So this is a collab with my beautiful friend Lauren. So make sure you go and check her unicorn look out as well. It will be linked below. So first of all, I'm just starting off using a lip pencil to map out where I want the ice cream to drip. And then I went in with some white cream face paint and mixed it with a bit of pink face paint as well. I'm just doing that all over where the dripping is mapped. And I'm going in with a fine detail brush to go around the edges and make sure that I get it really neat. And then I'm just going in with the white face paint on all the high points of my face on the other side. Now I'm going in with my NYX Ultimate Brights palette and going in with this lovely mint colour. I'm just going in and shading where the ice cream is so it looks like it's causing a shadow on my actual skin. And then I'm going in and doing a bit of contour as well. So now I'm going right up to the edges of the dripping ice cream to create more depth with the shadow. I'm basically just doing where all the curves are. And then I'm going in with a fluffy brush and just blending that out a bit more. And now I'm going in with the white face paint and just doing highlighting on the drips just to create more depth with the ice cream so it looks like it's 3D and I'm just going on on the high points of my face as well to highlight them. Then back in with the NYX palette I'm using this gorgeous lilac colour. I'm just going to lightly shade on the dripping areas just to add a bit more depth again. It's all about the depth and adding shade to this look to make it more realistic. And then back again with the hot pink and just doing this on the high points of the drips. Then I'm going in again with the lilac shade to do some eye makeup and then using the hot pink to go over the top. And now I'm just blending it all into the paint so that the shades look more realistic. So I'm going back in with the mint colour. I'm just going to do the other side with the eye makeup. So I'm going in with the light colour first and blending that all around the eye area. And then going in with the darker colour and just going in the crease and bringing it under the eye and then blending it outwards. This just adds more depth and makes the eyes more prominent on that side of the face. And then I'm using the darker colour again to do the contour and the high points of my face just so it's more coloured on that side of my face. I felt it was just a bit too plain. Then I'm going in with some glitter fix on my eyebrow and just painting that on where the hairs are. Then placing some MAC pink glitter on top of the brow. I also did the other side but I'm just showing you this side. Now I'm just going in with some Barium Liquid Chrome and I'm just placing that on and then blending it outwards. And then going over the top with Makeup Revolution Peach Lights Highlighter just to set the liquid and add a bit more glow. I just went around the rest of my face doing the high points with the highlighter too. Now I've popped on some Ardell Wispies and I'm going in now with the Colourpop Marshmallow to do a base for my lipstick. 
And while that's drying, I'm just going in with some mascara to blend my lashes with the falsies. Now I'm going in with Lime Crime's Diamond Crusher in Trip, which is so beautiful. I love this colour. I'm obsessed with it at the moment. So now I'm going back in with the NYX White Liner, just to highlight the white points again. I felt that they weren't white enough. So I'm just going over the top of them to make them more vivid. And that is all the makeup done. And I just popped on my ears and my pink wig and stuck the ice cream to my head. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I had so much fun doing this quirky fun look. I think it was a really good twist on the unicorn makeup theme that me and Lauren sat. As well, make sure you go and check out Lauren's video. She has done a gorgeous glam unicorn look. So make sure you go over there and send her some love. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, remember to click the like and subscribe. And I will see you next time for the next Glamoween tutorial.